somebody find it. So cool. So we arrived at the market, maybe a few hours too late, and so they're packing up. But we're gonna have a nose around and see what we can find. Today we're in the town of Kyoto in Gunma Prefecture, which is roughly two hours from where we live in Karuazawa. We're here to explore an antique market that takes place on the first Saturday of every month. It's a fantastic market, and if you're there early, you can find some great deals. Really is a shame because it looks like we got here just a little bit too late. And everybody's packing away, but on a, a really good day, it's just packed with people, packed with antique stuff, and you really can get some cool things. So we have a stall of yukata and kimono. Very pretty silk. You want to come check out this one? That. You like that in your hand? This market has a variety of different antiques, but my favorite are those from the Edo period. As you see here, you can find samurai armor, swords, money, and many other items. You can also find other items from the Second World War. In the past, I've seen war bonds, helmets, and various other war-related antiques. So there are no toys anywhere to be found. Which is one of the things that we told that Penny that she could have, right? Yep. What are we trying to do? Find a toy. Trying to find a toy? Japanese antique toy? Yeah. Though we were not able to find Penny an antique Japanese toy, nor did we get to see the market's full inventory of items, we did have a great time walking around. We were able to get out of the house, escape the snow, and see a different part of Japan. <laughs> and as we do on most day trips, we finished the day with a stop at a local restaurant. Today's food stop is our favorite bakery in Kiru. We had pastries, coffee, and were able to escape the cold. We're in the bakery and they have lots of yummy food. Penny wants a strawberry milk and we're gonna check out all the breads. Ooh! You don't know what you're gonna eat? 